great morning to you. It is time for the buzz and you know what? It's the talk of social media this morning. The National College football champs greeted with a feast when visiting President Trump at the White House. Take a look. And I said, you guys aren't into salads. We have Big Macs, we have Quarter Pounder with cheese, we have everything that I like that you like. <laughs> and I know no matter what we did, there's nothing you can have that's better than that, right? Yeah, the Clemson Tigers feasted on McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's, pizza, and so much more. Now here's the buzz. President Trump covered the cost since much of the White House resident staff is furloughed. Now this clip has social media on fire this morning and even last night. Let's get straight to a couple of the comments. You have Harriet that says this is definitely a slap in the face to Clemson. It seems like it would have been more respectful not to have invited the team. Then you have Spencer that says I'm an Alabama alumni and even I think Clemson deserves better than that. And then Heather made a great point. She says, I don't see any McFlurries or cones. Ooh. Guess their ice cream machine is still down. Oh. Referring to McDonald's. She didn't have to do that. But yeah, a lot of people talking about, you know, maybe Chick-fil-A might have been the better option than some just saying fast food. No. You know, I'm wondering if there's some underlying shade there. Maybe he's not a fan of Clemson. Here you go. Ethan. I don't know. I don't know. It's <laughs> I mean, let's be realistic. It's a nice gesture you fed them, but right. you go somewhere like the White House, you're expecting a grand meal, you I know? Some steak or something. Yeah, man, something good. Big guys like that. You know, I, I think it's a big nothing burger. A nothing burger with two all beef patties, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on a sesame, sesame seed bun. bun. How about a Big Mac for Clemson winning the natty? <laughs> Let's get to Mike Prangley.